Good morning, it's Ada Sparks with the Word of Hope. I have a scripture here for you. And in the scripture, it's talking about in the end times because, you know, people are talking about the end times. Um, they're gonna get kind of scary, you know, like when things do kind of get weird. It's probably gonna get a little bit tough on the church, you know. We've seen a little bit of that in other parts of the world. We haven't really experienced that much here in America. But the scripture says in Luke 21 and 14, settle it therefore in your hearts not to meditate before what ye shall answer. And that's really King James version there. It almost sounds Shakespearean. But basically what it's saying is this, determine right now what your answer is going to be. Determine it right now, settle it in your heart right now. If you were to get called on the carpet and someone were to ask you, do you believe in God? Do you? Do you really believe in God? Settle it right now in your heart. What's your answer gonna be? If they were to say, I'm gonna take your house, do you believe in God? Do you? Is it worth your house? Settle it. What's your answer? I had a conversation with someone recently and I said, I 100% believe. I have no question, no doubt. God has proven himself to me so many times in amazing ways, just un unprecedented ways over and over. He knows I'm a little bit like Gideon. I kind of need that. Okay, God, I, I understand you answered my prayer this way, but how about this way? Okay, I get it. But how about this way? I needed that. I, like doubting Thomas, you know, over and over in the Bible, God knows our personalities and he sees that some people just need a little bit of over and over and over encouragement. I'm one of those sometimes. He doesn't admonish us for that. He respects that that's our personality. He's the one who created us. I'm not saying there haven't been times that I've been angry with God. I have. I've been frustrated with him. I've even said, you know, I don't even want to speak to you right now. I did not like the way you answered this prayer. Maybe you don't even hear my prayer. We've all been there. We've all had those moments. I even had a season in my life where I had to forgive God. I was so angry with him. I had to forgive him. Later, I had to ask him to forgive me for being so angry with him. And never once have I doubted he existed. Never once have I doubted that he was there, or who he was. Settle it in your heart today that you know who he is. And be wise, not afraid, because even when we doubt him, he's still there for us. God bless.